I'm Dr. Judith Salmon Coward, the first Young Investigator Awardee. Thank you to the Conquer Cancer Foundation. I had no idea that I would win that award, uh, but I was presented with it uh, at the ASCO meeting in 1984 in Toronto, Canada. And the emphasis was that this was just the beginning, that there would be lots of other investigators who could be supported. I studied different receptors that might be uh, associated with uh, growth phase of malignant melanoma. That was funded by the first Young Investigator Award. The Young Investigator Award uh, kept me stimulated to continue to try to find ways to address treatments of malignant melanoma. And while bench research was one approach and still is needed, I also became very interested in clinical trials research. It's just very exciting to have people challenge you with questions of, well, why this? Why does it work that way? What's a better treatment for a patient? How do you know which patient to treat with which drug? So it's the patients themselves that you want to always do your best for. Uh, the needs of the patient come first. I feel sort of like the mother of the Young Investigator Awards. <laughs> In fact, uh, one of my former fellows uh, was a Young Investigator Award recipient six years ago. The Young Investigators constantly challenge us to think about what we're doing and why we do it and can we do something better. I remain very excited about research and try to contribute to clinical trials, to mentoring uh, junior researchers. I made a donation this morning to the Conquer Cancer Foundation because I strongly believe that we have many more good research ideas and good researchers that we need to support that aren't being funded by other mechanisms and uh, I am glad to be able to encourage those people to stay in cancer research.